change it. I'm going to zero right now. Alright. Shout outs to this commentary of you teaching me how to use this being on stream. <laughs> Shout out to Hunter. Shout out to Mario. His name is Mario, actually. Oh shit, like his real name? Yeah. Yo, that's fucking tight. Oh, I did not just swear on stream. Nope. Yeah. My, my I mean, it's 64. No one watches 64. My Twitch name is Paco Smoking Rocks. So. Uh, hey, there you go. Someone commentate with me. It's awkward yeah. when I do it alone. Awesome. All right, we got P21 slash C here on commentary with? Uh, my name is Dad's Musical Erasers. Awesome. And I am new to 64, and that's why you haven't heard of me. Sweet. Well, it's good to have you, man. Thanks for organizing this tournament. Thanks for coming. So uh, you're probably not aware of the players here. So these are no. two, two people who've been going to a lot of tournaments recently. Uh, of course, Muse is our local streamer. Who we appreciate a lot, and he has a really good uh, Fox and Falcon that I've, I played at least. But he's going uh, Yoshi here, which is kind of cool. I can see some tech. Uh, he's definitely been practicing with him too. I mean, he's got my color, so you yeah. know he's channeling the spirit of me. Yeah. So these eggs do really well against some characters and can definitely harass Mario. And uh, seems like Muse is definitely putting some pressure out there with them. Yeah. Uh, now we got the those, fireball those fireballs games. though. Oh, this shot to those. Oh, and the double armor, or he uh, double jumps through that to use the armor. Nice F tilt string, but it didn't really lead into maybe what he wanted it to. Oh, and this is, up, he lost his jump, uh, but he down bees to the stage safely, which is a, a good idea in that situation. Or at least it worked at that time. So I don't know if you know this. You're a Yoshi main, correct? I am a Yoshi main. Uh, so the Yoshi's one and down only. tilt is actually um, fixed knockback. So is it no actually? matter what oh, percentage okay. you're at, it hits you the same distance. So it's a fantastic tool against certain that. characters, especially ones that uh, struggle after they lose their second jump. So um, Mario doesn't necessarily struggle with that, uh, no, but it's def but definitely still a really good tool. Yeah, but Mario happens sure. to be one of the hardest to edge guard. I mean, that would make sense, yeah, because his recovery is pretty, pretty okay. good. Yeah. And then they nerfed it in every other Ooh, game. Oh, okay. He mashes out correctly and doesn't accidentally That is unfortunate. I actually took a stock off Muse by doing that earlier. So I was always I was actually really proud of that stock. All right, we got some low percentage right. neutral here. He comes in with a slow fall nair. Yeah, so that up air certainly isn't going to lead into a, an effective edge guard unless he's able to follow up after. Uh, so typically with Yoshi's double jump uh, recovery, you want to put a multi-hit move out there because yeah. then he's in the hit the hit stun, I guess, the yeah. double jump hit stun the entire time. Easier That's said than done, though, of course. Yeah. Unless you're Kirby. Yeah. And there's the Kimi Maru, the, uh, the up smash to get the stock. And we're here with three to one stocks. So Muse is going to have to get a stock here pretty quickly without taking too much damage. He wants to stay at low percent. Because uh, he'll lose his double jump armor when he gets the high percent. That's true, yeah. Also, you know, being at low percent is just, just, just a good thing, you yeah, know. Yeah. It's like, it's like, it's like, it's like education, you know. Everyone, <laughs> everyone just kind of agrees that it's a good thing, unless you're dumb. But. Okay, we got something started here. Nice jump out. That wasn't safe if you tried to stay and do more up tilts. Okay, can you get something going here? Oh, he tried to Rip. follow up with the nair, which is a good idea, but it's just a little bit I feel late. like an up air might have been better. I would have done a down air, a rising down air. Maybe, yeah. Because it covers yeah. the tech, but um, it, he might have had to commit to a specific tech option. Uh, so the nair sometimes also covers that, but he was just a little bit slow. But now he gets Mario off the stage. I think that egg maybe was a mistake. I know it's, it's much better to do the egg when you're on the stage, because then it goes lower and covers either the high or the low option, yeah, depending on how you angle definitely. it. But Egg is definitely a, an interesting move. I don't, yeah. I still, I like, I still don't know whether or not mm -hmm. it's like good to use in the neutral, but. Yeah, I think uh, hey, it's, 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 at really high levels, you can see people are just, are, are very efficient with the egg. I'm to sure. To the point where, uh, where people are, are, 
are used to, to dealing with it, so they uh, recover accordingly to get around it. But oh, and then Hunter uses the back air to break Rip. the armor there to take the uh, the first game. Let me adjust that. Uh, uh, yo, how do you change the number? Go to two and one, and that, that corresponds to the number. Okay. Um, okay. All right, now right, here we Lisa's go. Game two. To Falcon. Uh oh. So I think this is a maybe a character he's more familiar with. At least I've seen him play it more. And that was definitely a string they're used to, but the upbeat just came a little bit late, and Hunter yeah, was out of range. Okay, but Hunter goes a little too low. I can see what he was trying to do, but he fast fell and then uh, didn't upbeat in time, unfortunately. Oh, and that up tilt was probably a mistake. I'm guessing that was supposed to be either an up smash or maybe he thought he was Yoshi for a little bit there. <laughs> Because the, uh, the up tilt's not a great neutral move. Sometimes it's a really good edge and guard, though. with Falcon, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I feel like up tilt's, like, it's so slow. Mm -hmm. so it's, it's a like, really big hitbox that lasts that's for forever. Because it that's has true. actually two hits to it. That's true. Uh, but that was a really good downer by Hunter to, to force uh, the low edge guard, or to, to cover the ledge, low edge guard there. Right, can we get a combo? Oh, and no. he tries yep. to pivot up, uh, up air, reverse up air, but... I think didn't, the, pivot, didn't work, yeah. the pivot to the jump, there's a little uh, gap there, which is why it didn't work. A good idea with these up Bs, that can definitely uh, kill, I think, or at least put in a really good edge guard opportunity. For sure. Let's see if he can follow this up. Mario does a pretty good job when he's in that region uh, recovering, but uh, Hunter, I think, accidentally upbeat onto stage. He was probably trying to go for the, uh, uh, the edge, or maybe he thought the fireballs were going to cover him. Uh, here we go. Oh, no. Uh, accidentally shields, unfortunately. Rip. Ooh. I love that down air. That down air is like just such such a cool move, you know? Yeah, yeah. What was that? He knew he wasn't going to get it. I guess back. that's, yeah. yeah. Okay, sure. So now we got a really even game here. So That's true. Whoever gets Stocks uh, are even. a good opening is going to have a good advantage going forward. Oh. oh, that up B didn't come out in time. It did not. That was unfortunate. I was looking forward to that. So I think Muse is doing a really good job uh, with his his uh, attack choice in neutral. He's doing a lot of back airs, but unfortunately it didn't quite connect in these last couple exchanges. Uh, Hunter comes in with a good down air, oh, but, but that unfortunately up air it doesn't work connect well. on the up air, yeah. But comes falls down with a nice nair to force Falcon off stage, and then he just edge guards to the other side. And uh, unfortunately, uh, Falcon kind of has no option if he doesn't have a second jump from that far out. Yeah, Falcon's recovery is not the best. Oh, unfortunately he used his jump and then got too low uh, with the down B. He didn't rise far enough, or uh, high enough. Yeah. Oh, there's the up tilt. See, it kind of covers a lot of space. It definitely does. Mm -hmm. But I feel like it's not the best combo move, maybe. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's, it's definitely I've slow. seen it at high levels, but... <laughs> um, I def def definitely don't know how to connect it with other moves in a combo. Yeah, I'm, I'm not a Falcon main, so... I mean, I'm just ex inexperienced in general, so I don't, I don't really know what I'm talking about, to be well, honest. Let's see if he... Okay. I'm just here so to think... try and keep it interesting, you know? <laughs> yeah. That's what's up. Okay. So he keeps doing these forward throws, which I think at this percent don't link necessarily. Maybe the previous forward throw would link into a, a reverse... a pivot reverse up air. Um, but he does cover the ledge with the back air nicely there. It's just a big move that... Uh, a big hitbox that stays out, and uh, you can usually land, Z cancel it, and recover correctly. Okay, so really just reset the neutral here. Muse definitely needs a good opening, and he, he really doesn't want to go off here stage we go. here. Here we go. It's an important. Oh, nice oh. recovery there with the forward air, but unfortunately he shields. I think that's going to be it. Grabs, and that's, and yeah, that looks that's, like the set. That's game. A rip. Yeah. That was a good set. Uh, it's that fun was a to good see. Set. Uh, I had a really fun time watching Yoshi or Muse's Yoshi, who I haven't seen before. Uh, I think it's kind of cool that he's a really fun out. character to watch. I think Mario yeah. and Falcon are both really fun characters yeah. to watch. Yeah, that was a, that was a good set. Definitely, definitely. I think uh, a couple, you know, if some of those exchanges uh, that were, were really close ended up going Muse's way, he definitely could have easily won that game too. And yeah, then definitely. you know, you never know what's going to happen. I mean, they were three. both definitely close games, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. Cool, so I don't know exactly what's going to be our next game. Let me check out the bracket. All right, so uh, until we get figured out, we're going to put some friendlies on. That's just going to be the Muse and Hunter again. So. Cool, 
cool. So again, this is just friendly. So I think uh, I'm not the TO, so I'm gonna make sure we get the correct game up on stream next. Technically, I'm the TO, but I haven't <laughs> exactly done a whole lot of good job TOing. Kind of just, it's my first time, so. Well, my first real time. Okay, so we have three games left. Um, I'm sitting in winner's side going up against Natty in winner's finals. Uh, I think we're gonna either do that next or one of the loser's rounds. Uh, I believe these are the loser's quarterfinals. Um, so it's either gonna be Blonde Kid versus Mocked or Paco versus Hunter. And so uh, unfortunately, Paco versus Hunter, that's a, I think they play each other all the time. They're, um, you know, they live in the same region or, uh, of, of NorCal. So it's unfortunate that they would meet, but I guess when you're this far in the bracket, you can't really expect to avoid anyone. That's right. Definitely played against my friend multiple times in bracket in <laughs> melee, yeah. and he's a lot better than I am, so that was really unpleasant. Mm -hmm. and Every so, time. Yeah. But, uh, I think yeah. we're going to do these losers. We should do the losers first, and then we'll do the winners, and then the losers uh, semis. You said winners first? Yeah. Okay. Uh, 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 no, sorry. The losers, losers first. first. Yeah, yeah, okay. Both of these matchups. Okay. That's, that's what I would assume. Just leave? I have no idea. So wait, how do I switch it back to the stream? Oh. Okay. Oh, I'll tab. Okay.